Okay, just a quick wee video on uh, some hot bluing of some of these bolts. Um, they've been glass bead blasted to give them a nice clean surface and a quick dunk in, uh, in thinners just to remove any of the dust. What we're going to do now is fire up this old uh, blowtorch here, get a glowing cherry red hot, and then dunk it in some really loud diesel oil. Well and truly used diesel oil. That's what I found to be given the best results. I'm just going to fire up the blowtorch now. Just bear with me a second. Apologies for the noise. But the trusty old Stilsons. One's ready. Get it. Sit in. Front of the plane. Shouldn't take too long. Just the tip of a very vivid blue flame at the hottest point. See so it's starting to glow. Obviously, the smaller bolts, the quicker the process. Some of the larger ones, like that one down there. Uh, take about five minutes to get glowing cherry red off. This is only a little M5 bolt, this M4 M5 5 bolt. So, see if you're starting to get hot now. And all these little bolts, they're not uh, what I call load bearing bolts, they're all just like fast and slow. I don't know, like tie and blade covers. Uh, alternator bracket, bracketry, you know, not really what you call critical load bearing stuff, so I wouldn't do it on things like engine mounting bolts, uh, it can affect the uh, structural composition of the bolt uh, and cause it to fatigue. So as you can see now, that bolt is glowing cherry red. Take it out of the flame, there we go, got to do it quickly, dunk it in the oil and wash. Take care not to breathe in this stuff, because it stinks. Not obviously good for your health. Just let it bathe in there. Dunk her in and out. Uh, good coating in there. A really good coating. So, just pop you down for a second so I can turn that blow torch off, save the gas. Oh, yeah, that's, that's a bit better. say so she's cooled down a bit now so we'll pop her down here but to cue the old blue peter here's one i made a little bit earlier still probably a bit warm that's been sitting there for about half an hour now but that is a jet black if the bug were bloody focus but you see what i mean there it's a lovely gloss black finish there and you can see some of the other bolts i've done down here see some of the larger ones again They've come out absolutely fantastic, these have, and hopefully should give it some rust protection for a good long time. Well, I hope this video has proved useful for some people. Uh, it's a nice way to tart up and dress up your engine bay, whilst giving a bit of uh, protection as well. Um, so hopefully I'll start doing a few more of these videos. I hope you enjoyed and it's been useful, and I shall catch you all very soon.